Avanti is launching new video series. Tune in every Monday for JE problem solving and every Saturday for a class 10 video. We will also be releasing exciting science videos. So subscribe now so that you never miss an update from us. We all sleep for a third of our lifetime and yet we know almost nothing about what happens when we sleep like dreams. You all must have had a dream at some point or the other. But rather the question that baffles most people and even scientists is what causes dreams? Now there are a lot of conflicting hypotheses. One of the most famous ones says that some memory processes can take place only when we sleep and dreams are a signal that these processes are taking place. So what happens is while we're asleep, the unconscious part of our brain is busy organizing memory, collecting and strengthening the ones from the day before that we're going to need in future and getting rid of the junk that is not needed so that it doesn't clog our brain. This organization takes place in the form of electrical impulses and when these are detected by our conscious brain, it goes crazy. It doesn't know what it is, so it tries its best to fit it in a story which we see as a dream. This explains why most of the things that we see in our dream are related to happenings of the day. This also explains why dreams are completely random because our brain cannot infer them. And actually our brain is not supposed to infer them. It is just some noise that our brain is trying to make sense out of. But then again, this is just one of the hypotheses and many more theories exist. One theory suggests that we dream to remember because probably dreaming while sleeping is better to remember an activity like playing an instrument. One more famous theory suggests that we dream to solve problems. Our problem solving skills are much better when we sleep and this is demonstrated in history by many many examples. If you've heard about this chemist named August Kekulé, he, like many other scientists, was baffled about what is the structure of benzene or C6H6 when one day he finally decided to sleep on it. And believe it or not, he saw the structure of benzene in his dream, which we know as today. And all the experiments conducted till date have validated the structure to be correct. Not only scientists, many musicians and artists also have experienced this. For example, Paul McCartney, member of the famous band Beatles, dreamt of the melody of their song Yesterday in a Dream, which went on to become one of the most famous hits of that time. Not only this, James Cameron saw the story of Terminator in a dream. Niels Bohr saw his structure of the atom in a dream looking like a solar system. Mendeleev caught his idea of periodic table in a dream. So are you stuck with the problem? Maybe go sleep on it. But the intriguing things taking place or related to while we sleep or brain do not end here. Have you ever woken up from a sleep unable to move? Your eyes are open, you can see your surroundings and the surrounding movement but you just can't move. If yes, then you have experienced what scientists call as sleep paralysis. So why does this happen? When we sleep, we go through cycles of REM and non-REM sleep. Out of these two, REM is the stage where we dream. During this part of the sleep, some neurotransmitters like GABA and glycine turn off our muscles. And this is really important to do and is done in order so that we don't start enacting out our dreams. And if you ever happen to wake up in the middle of a REM cycle, that is when you experience sleep paralysis. You are awake but your muscles are still sleeping so you can't move. You must have heard about people who talk or walk in their sleep and this happens because they're never able to achieve the REM stage. So their muscles are never turned off and they start enacting out what they see in their dream. Our brain has a lot of interesting experiences to offer. We know the answers to some, for some we're completely clueless like dreams. Thousands of scientists study human brain as a full-time career and yet haven't been able to uncode it completely. If you are an enthusiast and such study excites you, then download our app today to study more about human brain and its working. The link for downloading our app is given in the description of this video. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon below. Thanks for watching. You can now access all of our videos from class 9th to 12th on our app. Download it now through link given in the description.